In this tutorial, I'm really excited to show you guys a feature that I know a lot of you have been waiting for, which is the ability to edit your activity posts. To enable this feature after updating BuddyBoss platform to the latest, go into BuddyBoss settings, activity, and then check this box for edit activity, allow members to edit their activity posts. And then we also tell you for a duration of, and you can set how long people are able to edit a post after publishing it. So the default is forever. It means once a post is published, the user can edit that post at any time they want forever. Or you can switch it to some specific amount of time if you want to limit the duration for how long people can actually edit the post afterward. So we give you these predefined options for a month or a week or a day, an hour, or as low as 10 minutes if you'd like. So I have this set to forever. And I come back to the front end and you saw me edit it a moment ago. I'm just gonna edit it again. And let's say, I wanna make that bold and I'll add a second image. And I can also change the privacy. I'll set it to all members instead and click post update. And just like that, my post has been updated. You can see the privacy change, the photos changed, the bold was added. And this little thing here shows that the post has been edited. So I'm gonna come back here and change it from forever to let's say seven days and click save. So now any post older than seven days cannot be edited. Let's refresh. And now we can see that this post, which is two weeks old, no longer has an edit button. But if I go ahead and add a new post, That one is less than seven days old, so I can still edit this one. The interface is deceptively simple. Behind the scenes, a lot of logic has to be in place to make sure that if you add a photo, delete a photo, add a document, delete a document, that this doesn't break things around the network. But we've got everything working now and we're really excited to finally put this in your hands.